The safety stopper can stop or remove a Mueller no-blow service tee with or without the brass completion plug. For demonstration purposes, we will show both, starting with the brass plug missing. This demonstration will show the actions necessary to safely stop a 1-inch Mueller no-blow service tee. Using the Masco safety stopper, we are going to remove the cap from a Mueller no-blow service tee. Place the packing seal over the service tee with the bevel facing downward. Loosen the cap slightly. Next, mount the appropriately sized reducer ring. Place the two packing retainer half collars under the packing seals. Place the cap housing over the half collars. Install the packing retainer nuts and tighten. Place security restraining strap assembly onto the cap housing and loop the restraining strap under the main line. Thread the isolation valve onto the cap housing. Attach the appropriately sized cap removal adapter and housing onto the isolation valve. Close the bleeder valve on the isolation valve. Lower the cap removal tool into the cap housing until the tool engages the cap. Once the cap is engaged, rotate the tool counterclockwise to remove the cap. Raise the cap removal tool up until it is completely out of the valve. Close the isolation valve and open the bleeder valve until pressure is completely released. Now remove the cap removal tool. The cap has now been removed. Before placing the expander plug into the service tee, first place the expander plug into the expander tool and place the tool alongside the tee and slide the marking indicator down the shaft. This will mark the depth of where you wish to place the plug. Thread the expandable plug tool onto the top of the isolation valve. Close the bleeder valve. Open the isolation valve and lower the expandable plug down into the service tee to the pre-measured depth. Turn the expandable plug tool handle clockwise while holding the tool shaft until tight. This will expand the plug to close the hole where the service tee is connected to the main pipeline. The plug is now in place. Bleed the service line down in a safe location. Confirm the bleed off by opening the bleeder valve. Disengage the expander tool from the plug and raise the tool shaft. Remove the safety stopper tool. All rubber seals can be reused many times. A new brass completion plug can be installed if desired. Using the safety stopper, I'm going to remove the brass completion plug from a Mueller Noblo service tee. Remove the cap. Thread the appropriately sized thread adapter onto the tee. Thread the isolation valve onto the service tee threaded adapter. Thread completion plug removal tool onto the isolation valve. Close the bleeder valve on the isolation valve. Lower the completion plug removal tool and engage the completion plug. Turn the tool counterclockwise to unthread the plug from the service tee. Close the isolation valve and open the bleeder valve. After removing the brass completion plug, you can reverse the previous steps to reinstall the brass completion plug.